Let's write 5% as a fraction and then as a decimal. So let's start off with the fraction. When we see the percent sign here, that means per 100. So we have 5 per 100. And there's your fraction, 5 over 100. So 5%, you could write that as 5 one hundredths. That would be a fraction. We could even simplify this, though, to lowest terms. 5 divided by 5 is 1, and 100 divided by 5 is 20. So we could simplify this down to 1 20th, which is another fraction for 5%. These are equivalent. They're both equal to 5%. As a decimal, one way to think about it is we take our fraction, 5, and divide it by 100. So we take our 5, and we're dividing by 100. So 1, 2 decimal places. So we go 1, 2 decimal places, put our decimal point here, and then a 0 would go here. So the fraction 5 one hundredths, or 5%, that's going to equal the decimal 0 0.5. And often you'll see a 0 put in front like this. And you could divide 1 by 20, since these are equivalent fractions here, and you'd end up with 0 0.5. So that's how you do it. This is Dr. B converting 5% to a fraction and to a decimal. Thanks for watching.